plans for making the world's first full-scale floating wind turbine started in 2001. On the 22nd of April 2009, the substructure built in Finland was towed to Stavanger in Norway. I mean, it's, it's really exciting, uh, of course. You see so much good science and so much engineering coming to life. It's a project with a huge potential. This wind turbine is a pilot that will be tested for two years. The experience will give valuable knowledge on how to perfect the technology. Well, we're looking at building a commercial business within uh, clean energy and uh, we think that uh, offshore wind is going to be a big market segment and uh, with our capabilities from the North Sea we have a lot to offer. Building such a massive floating structure takes time and many key factors have to be in place before the wind turbine is complete. The idea is to use software to control the windmill blades in a way that stabilizes the structure. And now they have poured in water uh, to a point where it has upended itself. And then they're filling in gravel and stones to make it lower in the water, almost like a keel of a sailboat. Then uh, the ship will come and put in the tower in two pieces. And then the generator or the little power station at the top. And then finally the three blades. The structure will be 100 meters under the sea level and 65 meters to the top of the tower and then another 40 meters to the blades. So the diameter is about 80 meters, almost like a jumbo jet. So it's fairly big stuff. And then finally they will tow it out uh, to about 10 kilometers southwest of Kalmay, where the anchors are waiting and then through the summer they will commission it and start up in the fall.